Metaorganism research in Kiel started with novel technology, which enabled us to see the invisible parts of living organisms, from unicellular to plants to animals to humans. The, the whole world has become very germophobic, as if all germs were bad, and of course they're not. Today, we are not only acknowledging that microbes are specific and important partners of multicellular life. We have been able to recognize a whole new world that was not recognized before. My God, it's only been 10 years, and look at what has been put together here. But we are in the middle of functional analysis of the interactions between microbes and hosts, and microbes and microbes. The discovery is significantly challenging this concept of an autonomous individual bound itself. I was falling from my chair, you know, I had read all these papers by Sidney Brand. And we try to use the knowledge also in a translational sense by looking and bringing into context complex environmental diseases. We might live in a moment in which the concepts we have available to think about ourselves are changing again. And this has been eye-opening. Kiel's really in the vanguard of advancing, I think, a better appreciation of the natural world. Working in a complex field like host microbe interactions requires that you use interdisciplinary contacts and that you uh, work together very close with uh, colleagues and researchers from many different disciplines. That makes this group here a strong group and it also attracts attraction from researchers which around the world are focused on similar but not identical issues and uh, it's very natural that we are part of that international community. It is important for us to share the findings in the CRC with the general public because we believe that whatever we find is of interest for the people around us. And I think it will have a major impact on both preventive medicine and curing and diagnosis. I'm hoping that in five years we will really understand the nature of the interactions between the microorganism and the host. It is important to us that the people who are suffering from complex diseases and the people who are paying research that we understand host microbe interactions also benefit from that. And we hope that by understanding basic mechanisms, that we not only can understand basic functions of life and basic mechanisms of life processes, but that we also can approach environmental and modern diseases in a meaningful manner.